When checking to make sure an object is in equilibrium, it's not enough that forces up equal forces down and forces right equal forces left. We also have to balance torques. So for instance, in this uh, example, I'm going to put a 10 kilogram trash can two meters from the support and a five kilogram object also two meters from the support. What's going to happen when I remove the support is that the uh, system is going to rotate counterclockwise. I can balance this even though the masses aren't the same. So I can put the 10 kilogram trash can back at the 2 meter mark, the 5 kilogram trash can at the 4 meter mark, and when I remove the supports, it will remain balanced. What we're balancing here is we're balancing torques. So we have this 10 kilogram trash can, and he's creating a torque counterclockwise. We have the five kilogram fire extinguisher and he's creating a torque clockwise. And since it's in equilibrium, we know that torque equals torque. To find the torque, it's just a product of radius and force. So the radius and the force, when multiplied together for the trash can, must equal the radius and force when multiplied together for the fire extinguisher. Remember when you're measuring radius, you measure from the support to wherever the uh, force is being applied. So it would be this distance for the trash can, and it would be this distance for the fire extinguisher.